We are learning to make a 10 to add. Lesson four, five. Okay, here I have eight plus two, and I have two 10 frames that are gonna help me to add these two numbers together. First number I have is eight, so I'm going to draw eight circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to add two more. So here in the second 10 frame, I'm gonna draw two more. But remember, if you're going to make a 10, you need to fill in the first 10 frame before you go to the second 10 frame. So here, I've made a mistake. I need to make sure that they move into the, the first 10 frame so that I can create a 10. So here I have a 10, and in the second 10 frame, I have zero. So eight plus two is 10. Let's try another example. Here I have seven plus five. Again, I'm gonna start with the first 10 frame. I'm gonna draw seven circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then I'm gonna draw five more. One, two, three, four, five. Now again, Miss V's made a mistake because she did not complete the 10 frame. You need to complete the first 10 frame before you move on to the next 10 frame. So now I have a group of 10, so 10, and I have two left in the second 10 frame. So 10 plus two is 12. So seven plus five is equal to 12. Here's another example. I have five, one, two, three, four, five. And I'm gonna add nine more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I've learned from my mistake. Remember, when you have the 10 frame, you have to fill in the first 10 frame before you go to the second one. So now I've made a 10. I have made one 10, and then I have one, two, three, four in the second 10. So 10 plus four is 14. Therefore, five plus nine is equal to 14. All right, let's try this example here. Here I have seven plus four. And again, you're going to break the four down and you're going to help the seven to make a 10, okay? How can I make a 10? You can count up from seven and see how many more you need to make a 10. So put the seven in your brain, count up. Seven, eight, nine, 10. So I've made a 10. How many more did I need to make a 10? I needed one, two, Three. That three I'm going to write in the first circle, okay? Now, you have uh, another way you can do this part is either you can count up, so you can count up three, four, you, so you will need one more, or you can also do this if it's easier for you. You can draw four sticks, one, two, sorry, one, two, three, four, and then you can simply take away, if you wanted to, you could take away three, one, two, three, and therefore only one is left, so you can put the one here, okay? So, or you can count up, you can say three, count up one, which will be four, okay? So it's completely up to you. So now I have created a 10 because seven plus three is a 10. 10 plus one is equal to 11. Here's another example. I have six plus seven. Again, I need to make a 10. I'm gonna break the seven apart. To be able to do that, I'm gonna put the six in my brain and count up to 10 and see how many more I need to make a 10. One, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. So I will need one, two, three, four. I need four more. So now you can count up from four to count up to seven and see how many more you need. Or you can just draw sticks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And take away the four that you have already written down. So I'm going to draw one, two, three, four. So how many more do I need? I need three more. And you can check your answer because four plus three is seven, okay? 
Now I've made a 10. 6 plus 4 is 10. 10 plus 3 is 13. Let's try this example. Here it says 9 plus 8. To make a 10, I'm going to count up. 9 plus 1 is 10. So 9, 10. I have one red circle, so I'm going to write 1. You can use your fingers. You can hold out 8 fingers and take away 1. So how many are left? 7. So 1 plus 7 is 8. 9 plus 1 is 10. 10 plus 7 is 17. All right. I'd like you to open to page 123 and 124. We will do the activity together. So 6 plus 8. So you have 6 red and 8 yellow. So here you have 10. Here you have 4. So 10 plus 4 is 14. Question 2. 7 plus 4. You have 7 red and 4 yellow. How many is that? You have 10 and 1 more. So you have 10 plus 1, which is 11. Question number 3. 7 plus 8. This time I'm going to draw, okay? So I'm going to draw 7 circles first. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So I have 7 red circles. And I'm going to draw circles that are yellow for the 8. I'm, remember, I'm going to continue to fill this before I go to the next one. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Stop. So now I have 7 red and 8 yellow. Let's add them together. Here you have 10 and here you have 5. So 10 plus 5 is 15. 9 plus 4. I'm going to draw circles to help me. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I'm going to change the color so I don't get confused. I'm going to draw yellow circles now. So 1, 2, 3, 4, because I have 4. So here's 9 plus 4. 9 plus 4, I have 1 10, and then you have 3. So 10 plus 3 is 13. Question 5, 8 plus 5. Remember, we're going to do the count up method. So 8. I need 9 and 10. I need only 2 here. Okay? I'm going to put the 5 on my fingers and shilly 2. Take away 2. If you did that, you would know that it's 3 here. So 2 plus 3 is 5. Okay? So now you have created... You have created 8 plus 2, which gives you 10. 10 plus 3, which gives you 13. 7 plus 9. So I'm going to start from the 9, and I'm going to count up 9, 10. I need one more to make a 10. So right now I've created a 10 here, okay? Now, you have 7. Draw 7 sticks or hold 7 fingers, take away 1. The answer here will be 6. 6 plus 1 is 7, okay? Okay. So now I've done 9 plus 1. 9 plus 1 gives me 10. 10 plus 6 gives me 16. Okay, question 7. Beth has 6 baseballs. She finds 9 more baseballs. How many baseballs does she have? Draw to show your thinking. I'm going to use a 10 frame to help me draw. I'm going to draw 6 first. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then 9 more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. How many baseballs do I have? I have 10 and 5. So that would be 15. Extend your thinking. Show how to add 6 plus 7 in two different ways. Okay? So we can use the 10 frame. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then add 7 more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And you would get 10 plus 3, which is 13. You can also use this method. Here I have 6 plus 7. To get to a 10, I need to add 4 more to the uh, 6. So here I have 4. 6 plus 4 is 10. If I held up 7 fingers and I took away 4 of it, I would need 3 more. So 4 plus 3 is 7. So here I have 6 plus 4 is 10 plus 3 is 13. 
This is your homework for tonight, lesson 4-5, page 35 and 36 in your student practice book. Please complete it and then continue watching the video to take up the answers. Okay, let's take up the answers. So here I have question number one, six plus five, simply just count the circles. The answer will be 11. Number two, nine plus six. Remember, nine plus one is 10, plus five more gives you 15. What is the sum? Show how to make a 10 to add. Question three, seven plus six. So I'm gonna draw seven circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then I'm gonna change it to X's for the six. One, two, three, four, five, six. How many do I have all together? I have one 10 and I have three ones. So 10 plus three is 13. Four plus nine, <clears throat> to go from 13 to 10, I need to add more. So I'm going to put the four in my brain count up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stop. How many did I count? I counted one, two, three, four, five, six. I need six more. So four plus six is ten. Now I'm going to put the nine on my fingers and I'm going to take away six. If you did that, you would know that the other circle is three. So six plus three is nine. Okay. Now, four plus six is 10, plus three more is 13. Question number five, Kelly has eight pencils. Kari uh, has seven pencils. How many pencils do they have in all? In all means we have to add. So let's uh, fill in the number box. So here we have eight plus seven. So I'm going to work backwards a little bit. So seven, I'm gonna count it up to 10. Seven, eight, nine, 10. I need three more and five. So if you did eight fingers and you took away three, you will know that the remainder is five. So five plus three is eight. Now you have made a 10. Seven plus three is 10 plus five more is 15, okay? That's the end of the lesson, boys and girls. Have a lovely day, bye-bye.